So if you're taking off the spindle nut on a 2000 Suburban, I'm sure a lot of other GM cars actually have this spindle nut on it. You uh, might have a little bit of a hard time. It's uh, incredibly tight and difficult uh, nut to get off. I don't know, I think I'd rate it up there with a harmonic balancer bolt. Um, but anyways, uh, I'd just say you start with the, with the breaker bar and work your way out. And by that I mean, I got a bar that I added to it to increase the length, give me, give me some extra leverage, and then got an even longer piece out of a jack, and I threw that in there. And I couldn't actually crank this thing until I had about four to five feet of length. It was a lot. And that was with all my force I could muster. And also if you have taken the wheel, the wheel and tire off, um, you're gonna have to clamp down the caliper to keep everything from moving. So if you just put a clamp on it and then you get yourself a big breaker bar, then you might have a chance at it. It's pretty tough. Good luck.